Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Fable 3. Last episode, we finished up collecting all of the guild seals that we need to continue on with the main uh, quest line uh, and gain the trust of the uh, Bowerstone Resistance. Uh, however, decidedly noble air about you. It suits you. Yeah, thanks, Jasper. I'm wearing a, a noble suit. Maybe that's maybe that's why, or a noble outfit, I guess I should say. Uh, but anyway, we've gained, we've got enough guild seals to gain the trust of the Bowerstone Resistance, and we can move forward with the uh, main quest line. However, we are not going to move forward with the main quest line. Uh, like I've mentioned previously, I like to do a lot of the side quests and whatnot, the optional side quests before moving on. Uh, full disclaimer before we move on with this episode, I've been trying. Uh, to get the cool hilt that I want on the hero weapon, uh, the hero hammer, all of the hero weapons, I guess. Uh, however, I haven't been able to do it yet. Uh, I've been donating to beggars like crazy, uh, making friendships, doing friendly expressions, uh, you know, going to the road to rule, uh, opening the chest, and then exiting out of the game whenever I don't get the hilt that I want. Being a little cheaty, I must admit. Uh, yeah, I, I haven't been able to get the one that I want yet. Uh, so it's been a, a lot of off-camera just loading, quitting the game when I don't get the hilt that I want. I'm gonna continue trying, gonna continue trying, uh, until I finally get it. Maybe we'll finish the game without actually getting the, the hilt that I want. Who knows? Uh, anyway, we are on the lookout for some side quests. Uh, so I last left things off, at least with my, uh, attempts. Uh, to make friend, uh, friends and donate to beggars in Brightwall Village. Oh, another thing. Uh, I've made quite a bit of money. I've been buying stalls in Brightwall now. I've bought all the ones in the Dweller Camp. I've bought all of the houses and whatnot in the Mercenary Camp as well. I'm setting in on uh, Brightwall now. So as you can see, I have over 20,000 uh, gold coins. So quite the entrepreneur I am turning out to be. Uh, some of these... Some of these buildings are ridiculous. Where was the one that I was looking at that was just uber expensive? Um, hmm. Was it the bar? Maybe. There was one that I saw that was like, here you go. Uh, Matthew the Pawnbroker. 144,000 coins uh, that one cost. So the businesses and whatnot uh, certainly get pretty expensive. Uh, here's a good one. Escape prisoner or criminal is on the run in Brightwall Village. Bring him in. Uh, we have talked to this guy before. If you guys recall, we've we've caught a, uh, a runaway criminal for him previously. Boy, am I oh, hey. <laughs> we've got another crook on the run and we need your help. Right, right. I'm always willing to help. Thanks. Bring him in and I'll lock him up. Okay. No further instruction needed. Uh, this one wasn't too difficult last time. We just found the guy. He was, I think he was like standing by the bridge. And we just grabbed him. Dragged him over there. Uh, so most of these people that you see with the exclamation points over their head are people that I've been trying to make friends with. So I could get the hilt that I want. Hey, wait a minute. Hey. John, the house husband, are you the criminal? <gasps> Wait a minute! <gasps> it's the guy running! Uh, I was fooled! John, the house husband, fooled me! Dude, you're running right to the guard. If you don't buy my goods, Balverines will eat your children. No, really, I've seen it happen. Where are you going, buddy? Don't you just... Take too long. Don't want you're not gonna take me alive, copper. Now, do we? Oh, all right then, just this once. Dude! Guard, he ju literally just ran right by you. How terrible are you at your job? There, take him. What are you doing this for anyway? Did they put a bounty on me, Ed? I can offer you more. Ah, they call this one the butcher. People will feel safer tonight knowing he's behind bars, that's for sure. Thanks for your help. Make sure you come back soon. There'll be more work, I can just feel it. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Brightwall Village has uh, been cleaned up well done. Yeah, I mean, I didn't really do much. He ran right to you, and then I was just like, uh, whatever. Some guard you are. Now I see why you need the help of a hero. Uh, okay, well, that was uh, quick. That did not take very long. So let's see what else we got in Brightwall that we can do. 
Um, yeah, so a marriage of inconvenience. A married couple in Brightwell has been here. Now they've had enough. Perhaps you can help them separate. All right, let's do it. Shall we? We can do that one. Just knocking out the side quest, why not? Come on, doggo. Oh, beggar. Okay. Here. You are some sort of saint. Give money. I, love what you've I have figured out while doing this, uh, the beggars you can actually it's just repeatedly give one. money until you look, you um, they require you they require you to do like a quote unquote relationship quest. Uh, so that's what I've been doing. I've just been <laughs> throwing money at their faces. Oh man. Uh, I think this one already has a relationship. Uh, this one already has a relationship quest. Man, that's kind of uh, glitchy, I guess. I guess I could just stay in there all day and just donate money to her. Because uh, there's no end to the loop. Huh. Okay, interesting. I'll have to keep that in mind when I uh, play off camera trying to get the hilt that I want. Please, my sweet, please. I'm so sorry. I I I'll make it up to you. Well, I've heard that before. In the first few times, you disappointed me. Your clumsiness was sort of adorable in its way, but it's got a bit tired, hasn't it? My darling, please don't. I'm sorry. Please, let's not argue. It's so awful. Awfully boring, you mean? Perhaps if you ever won, it would be more interesting. When I married my wife, she was all sweetness and smiles. And now she's all bitterness and bile. She bullies me. She berates me. It's horrible. She's horrible. But if I divorced her, she'd get half my fortune, which is quite a bit of money. Oh, I wish I was someone else. Wait. What if she was with someone else? If a fellow like you... No. ...were to approach her, woo her, telling you got nope. more money than I do... She'd divorce me to marry you, and I'd be free and clear. Of course, you wouldn't actually have to marry her. Once she's divorced me, you could just walk away. Oh, I'd love to see the look on her face then. I know it sounds repugnant, but this could be my only way out. Will you do it? Uh... <laughs> I don't really know. I just kind of met you. Um, and I met her. Maybe you're the bad guy in this situation. Maybe she's the good wife. Maybe you're the Please bad husband. Help me to get divorced. All right. Whatever. Deserve, fine. You know? Fine. Should have. Should have got. Uh, got her to sign it. the prenup. Oh, this is the first. Good I like thing how that's happened to me in years. She's like, inside. You can start there. I know where she I'll is. The pub. I was just here. It shouldn't be too hard. You go in there and fawn over her. Give her a few shiny trinkets. Buddy. She'll be all over you. Work for me. Buddy, she's right there. She can probably hear you. Hello. I am a stranger in your house, louder? here Tell to woo you. you. Talk about things. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I thought you were my husband. <laughs> nope, just a stranger broken into your house. Confuse someone like you for someone like him. <laughs> so, uh, what can I do for you? <laughs> Uh, let's get married? Question mark? Looking good. Oh, would you like to good. dance? Let's dance. Mm. This is very, very weird. Just broke into your house. Now I'm dancing with you. Alright, have you been wooed? Is that enough? Is that how you woo somebody these days? I thought croquet was boring. Oh, you want to play patty cake? Follow me, baby. <laughs> uh, <laughs> awkward. Right. All right. Uh, want to get married now? How about something new to make me look fine? You are. Okay, I'm just gonna tickle you instead. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. 
All right, uh, give the jewelry to Veronica. I believe we have jewelry already. We've dug some up. Let's give her some not great. You're quite a bit of fun, aren't you? Much more diverting than that husband of mine. Do you right. know he spends all his time reading or gardening? <laughs> so dull. I can't remember the last time he did something nice for me, like buy me jewelry. I adore jewelry, by the way. I think we do, yeah, I think we do have some jewelry that we can give to her. Do I get to choose? Look at that. Oh, it is beautiful. Thank you. I love it. Uh, you're welcome. Now what? That looks... Oh, more chatting? Nice. Well, hello, handsome. I don't know about you, but I could do with a bit of hmm, excitement. Mm. <laughs> How about some more patty cake? Mm. Follow me. <laughs> Is that exciting enough for you? <laughs> Big slaps, yes. Big slaps, yes. If somebody was like. If somebody just happened to walk by or something like that while we were doing that, me something then. Don't and overhearing that, they would think that we would be doing something more lewd. Huh? <laughs> Alright, back to dancing. <laughs> yes, yes. Can I convince somebody to marry me within the span of one night? Very good. You're brilliant, darling. Just brilliant. Thank you. Sir? I'm gonna tickle you now. <laughs> I guess. This is just the same stuff that I was doing beforehand. Take Veronica on a date. Yes. It's been a long time. And it was exciting at first, flirting. <laughs> In my husband's house, but aren't you bored? Mm? We should go somewhere nice. How about Brighthall Bridge? I do like your uh, dress. It is very nice. I like the green. All right, darling, if you like. But that's about it. I'm not getting sedu I'm not the one getting seduced here. All right, are we not going to talk on the way? Am I just going to drag you to the bridge? Is your hair real? Is that real? Is that real hair? Oh, I can't like look at her because apparently we're still like holding hands and every time I move the camera She moves away Come on, keep it up. Let's hurry this up. Hold on, wait for me. I don't got all night All right, see it. There's the bridge. Let's go. <laughs> oh Wait, she meant like the uh, the big bridge outside of town All right, you see it? I'm gonna do the uh, quick tour. I love the view here, and you don't ruin it with a lot of talk. You just oh, stand there and look handsome. Mm. Oh, uh, there we go. Oh. Mm. Demonetized. <laughs> All right, are... Wow. <laughs> You've done that before, I should think. That or you have amazing instincts. I have to tell you. I've been with William so long I forgot how incredible it can feel to be with someone exciting. I want more. What do you say? We make a go of this. I'll leave William and you and I can be together. Yes, that is the evil plan. Can you I mean, me a ring? I do have some sense of tradition. Oh, do I have a ring? Oh, crimity. I don't have a wedding ring. Doggo, why haven't you found a, a dig spot for a wedding ring yet? Shoot. If you don't buy my goods, bell the rings will eat your children. No, really, I've seen it. <laughs> Hell of a sales pitch right there. We're keeping afloat here. Business could be better. Okay, um. 
I'm just gonna follow this gold trail because I'm assuming that it's gonna lead me to a place where I can buy a wedding ring. But also maybe not. I guess we'll uh we'll find out. Feel free to look around. Do you have a wedding ring? Oh you do have a wedding ring. Only 250 like gold coins? Remember, Absolutely I'll buy that. Refunds. What else do you have? A ruby? And jewelry. Okay, thank you. Thanks for your wedding ring. Appreciate it. Whew. This is a lot of running. Marriage is a lot of work. Oh, if I give her a ring, she's just going to want to keep it when I reveal the plan that we're not actually getting married. Oh, now I feel bad. But also, it needs to be done. It needs to happen. Alright, lady. Where'd you go? Did you jump off the bridge? Oh no, she's there. She just didn't load in at first, or I didn't notice her. You've got a ring. Next to the uh, flagpole. <gasps> You're gonna be very or banner pole, I guess. Resist, don't you? Go ahead and ask, and let's see how strong my resistance is. Okay. Well, this is the only time I'm gonna ask. Will you marry me? Yeah. Well, great, but Elise is the only, the only uh, girl in my life. Sorry. <gasps> now I just have to divorce William. Oh, I wish I'd met you five years ago. Would have spared myself a lot of crushing boredom. Okay. Well, that was easy enough. Don't look at me like that, doggo. I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm just helping a guy get out of a divorce or out of a uh, marriage. But now, wait a minute. If she divorces him, she's still like entitled to 50%. No, isn't that how divorces work? I don't know. I've never been divorced. I have no idea. I like how the little heart is just going up the hill <laughs> in a very like zigzag, janky motion. Excuse me, children. I gotta get married. Gotta go get married, or at least watch the, uh, watch the, uh, divorce unfold. Uh, I've got news for you, let me Tim. out. They're not going to like it, and let me tell you, that breaks my heart, truly. I've decided we're not right for each other. More specifically, you're not right for me. So, wow. Here are the divorce papers. You may consider yourself an ex-husband. Veronica, I don't know what to say other than thank you. Thank you for doing just what I knew you would. What? You planned this all along? Awkward. Sorry to say, I'll file these with the city clerk first thing tomorrow morning, and then we are officially history. Thanks again. Well, my enterprising love, aren't you a piece of work? Mm. You make a deal with a husband to split up his marriage and leave his wife penniless. Rather underhanded, I would say. I wonder just how despicable are you willing to be? Because if I think this through logically, if he never makes it to that office, the divorce never happens. And then instead of marrying a hot-blooded divorcee, you'd be landing yourself a very wealthy widow. What? You can't mean... You'd kill me? Well, technically, he'd kill you. <laughs> I'm sorry, William, but it is a lot of money. You haven't left me much of a choice. Don't listen to her. You can just... Walk away. This doesn't concern you anymore. The door's closed. I can't just walk away. I've been locked in here. I mean, I'm not going to kill him. I was kind of a jerk. I will admit. I'm sorry, lady. I will donate some of my fortune. I'm very wealthy. This is getting out of hand. Nobody has to die. Just walk away. Okay, I'm walking. I'm, go I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm not killing anybody. Sorry, Veronica. I enjoyed our kiss at the bridge. Goodbye. <laughs> uh, you have saved William from a fate worse than marriage. That's funny. Cool. Well, anyway. 
All in a day's work. Oh, my gem tart. You're not really going to divorce your true love, are you? You're unbelievable. You just tried to have me killed, and now you're trying to worm your way back into my heart. I was confused. This whole awful affair has reminded me how much I really love you. Let's just tear up those papers and start again. And as long as we're tearing, maybe we should have at these clothes as well. Oh, well. No. Wait a minute, I'm not falling for that. It's over! Get out of my house! Oh, all right, fine. You're a disappointment, William. I wanted to make it work, but if you don't want to try, I'll leave. And I've taken my jewelry with me. Fine. And good riddance. No. Oh. Uh, well, all right then. There we go. Uh, good enough. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. That's where I'm going to end things. Uh, if you did enjoy it, please definitely leave a like and a comment below, and while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed already. I do put out daily gaming videos, so be sure to do that so you don't miss anything, and I'll see you guys on the next episode.